Instapane's removable window grid kits. Now homeowners can add today's look to their windows and patio doors as easy as one, two, three. One, cut strips with scissors. Two, push strips onto connectors and attach Velcro. Three, press to window, removes instantly for cleaning. Not only are Instapanes easy to do without tools or complicated miter cuts, but they're durable, made of maintenance-free PVC vinyl for interior or exterior use. They never need painting, although they are paintable. Instapanes can decorate an infinite variety of sizes of windows. The only limitation is the number of strips and connectors contained in each kit. And Instapanes are so versatile, the decorating possibilities are endless. Hi, I'm Dan Harrison. You've just been introduced to a fascinating new product called Instapanes. Steve, it's an interesting product and a beautiful tape. The question that I've got is most of us have worked with PVC pipe in the past, but you seem to be able to come up with some way of cutting it with scissors. How did you figure that out? Well, we did it by trial and error, Dan, because uh, our, our goal was to have a strip that will cut with scissors. Otherwise, it's not going to be a do-it-yourself product mm -hmm. and without tools. And so we tool up and ran it until we found one that would cut the right thickness and yet have the rigidity we needed. Uh, consequently, it has a thin wall. But having a thin wall PVC, we didn't want it to crack like garbage can lids. I, I know you've mm -hmm. had them crack. So this is made out of a BF Goodrich Geon, which is uh, highly resistant to ultraviolet sunlight, and it's it's a material used in exterior home sites. Is this also paintable? Oh yes, you can paint it, correct? Any color, it's PVC. All right. Well, if it's easy to cut, how about letting me give it a try? Okay, here, try. Let me Cutting try a piece. Here's a 299 pair of scissors. Figure if I can do it, anybody can do this. And then here's so a connector. You can try and press that in there. Okay. That's it. Maybe I could hire myself out now. Yeah. I never knew that type of window was called divided lights. I'd always called them like windows with all the panes in them. Well, that's typical. Uh, the language in the window industry is uh, unique to its own, and most homeowners don't know terms like divided lights or sash. So the word panes came out very constant on our research, and that's why we named it Instapanes. Okay. So the way I understand it, up to now, nobody could buy grids for existing windows? Well, essentially, people can't buy grids for their windows right now. I can see where there'd be a problem if you measure wrong for, like, a custom window order. But what happens if you measure wrong for Instapanes? Well, we don't like to talk about mistakes, but I think with any uh, do-it-yourself product, people will make mistakes. Mm -hmm. Now, Instapanes has a, a real advantage in the fact that uh, since the strips are cut, if it's a little too large for your window, you just snip off the excess and it fits. That's easy. As well as since they slide on these connectors, you can expand the grid or up to about a quarter of an inch each connector. And, and most people are only off just a fraction of an inch, okay. so they can adjust it to fit their window. It's very easy. It all looks pretty easy, even to someone like me, but I think I found a problem for you. These little connectors, there's obviously space that's being taken up. Don't I have to do some kind of math, a subtraction or something? Well, we've thought of that, too. Each connector is exactly one inch or 25 millimeters. So let's say your window's 27 inches across. You deduct one inch, two inches, three inches. So that's 24 inches, and then two strips divided by two is 12 inches a strip. Even I can do that. <laughs> All looks simple enough, Steve, but even on the tape there, the young lady demonstrated one without the frame on it. That's correct. This, uh, a window can be divided uh, either with this uh, frame, uh, actually it's called a surround, or it can be removed and you just have the cross pieces within the window frame, which is without surround. Okay, so we can do it either way. That's right, either way. Well, with the, with the surround, I can figure out where you're gonna put the Velcro for the attachment where would you do it without it? Well, we didn't discuss the Velcro, but first of all, we use a very small piece, and it would go on the ends of the strips if you didn't have this round. Otherwise, you'd put okay. it on the corners. And here's the, here's the uh, size of the, the Velcro. Only a small piece like this is all that's needed, and that attaches to the grid. And then the other half attaches, of course, to the window. That's right. And that's it just peels apart. It's just a Velcro hook and loop. Can't be easier. We've established there are lots of different sizes of windows. How many kits do you make to fit all these different kinds of windows? Well, we offer three different kits. We have a, a starter kit, which will do some, uh, windows without the surround frame. And then we have a standard kit that'll do up to 15 lights with all the frame and the surround. And we have a deluxe patio and door kit. And how am I going to know which kit to buy? 
Well, it appears complicated because there's an infinite variety of uh, sizes, and it depends on how many you want to divide your window, how many lights mm -hmm. that you want to divide up your window. But the packaging deals with the amount of square foot coverage. That's the only way we can really do it. Uh, if you know the approximate size of your window, then you pick the kit from that. Okay. And the packaging is complete with uh, all the various combinations the kits will do. But we also have how-to literature that the consumers can take home and read and, and evaluate and measure the windows and go back and buy the kit. Okay, let's take, for example, a patio door that I'm going to want to give the French door look to. Well, it's got two parts, one that moves and one that doesn't. In this case, am I going to need two deluxe kits to accomplish that? Well, no, most patio doors do have two portions, and the deluxe patio door kit will do two window grids for the patio door. So the complete is all in it's case It's all there. Everything you need is there. Or you can do uh, six, up to 16 windows with the patio door kit. I mean, the, the product is essentially the same, but we position the patio door kit for picture windows or the larger. Okay. Give me a light. Divided light. Give me a light. No, light. Let's try to oh, I, I, you were waiting for my cue. Give me a light. No, 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 a light. Divided light. Give me a light. D divided light. <laughs> Give me a light. No, divided light. <laughs> I don't care what you guys say, I'm gonna...